Hi ninjas, today is, uh, you know, the little project I've been working on, which is top 16 anime songs. Now, before, whoa, <laughs> I was about to say, uh, I'm playing Pokemon Go, okay, hold on, yeah, and there's a Gerudo now, hold on, I'm sorry, okay, this is so cool, oh, <laughs> it's right on the computer, oh shoot, uh, I wish I could show you, but it's literally right there. What the? What? <laughs> Bro, I'm gonna show you a picture when I. Okay, uh, go! Yes! Oh! 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 Savage! Okay, I caught a Pokemon. I caught a Pokemon. This is Pokemon Go, if you haven't told already. So, what did I get, huh? What did I get? I got this guy. Oh yeah, look at them muscles, man. Them rock hard muscles. Ha, huh, pun intended. <gasps> I caught I caught a Pokemon in a video. Whoa. That's that's amazing. Okay. Well, anyways, let's go with the script because I got a script for this anime thing. And if Pokemon show up, I'm gonna stop the video. Okay, well not literally stop the video, I'm gonna stop reading this. But anyways, let's start the music all over again. All right, all right. And let's get on with this video. And I hope you enjoyed this video, so let's go. Ever heard of Pokemon theme? Speaking of Pokemon, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, ever heard of Pokemon theme, gotta catch them all? Or da 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 da. Well, music is one of the reasons why anime is super popular these days. So, yeah, that's why it's super popular. So, Ninja Geek Win, what's your favorite anime songs? Well, uh, hang on tight because, <laughs> wow, this video is getting on to a cringy start. But anyways, well, hang on you weeaboo ninjas because here is not five or seven or whatever number, but 16 anime songs but i have to say if i need a part two to this like you know part two then watch it please watch part two for me will you i mean besides you can't be satisfied with just one part you gotta have two parts and 16 is a long number anyways I, I can't fit this in one video but anyways let's just read the script now i'm gonna play the music in the background so yeah now uh okay uh, okay. okay, yeah. Now, six. Yeah, sixteen is Sakura Kiss from Aryan House Club. Aryan High School House Club. This opening is the. This opening is upbeat and romantic in a cute way, like so cute. Anyways, and all the members of the host club do it, and in the animation, all the members of the host club are doing what they do best. Like Tamaki, the the princely type, giving a rose to Haru, Haruhi Fuji. What the heck is that thing? Fu, Fujoka, the main protagonist. But it's 16 for a reason. It's just too cheesy for my taste. I know. That, like, you would not hear me say that, but yeah, too cheesy for my taste. And even though it's one of my, uh, it's one of the most upbeat songs in this list. It's not really that catchy. I mean, how can you have an upbeat song without the catchiness, bros? Ninjas, whatever you want to be called. I'm just checking Pokemon Go. Uh -huh. Okay, I'm sorry. <sighs> now, going for number 15 is... Is, 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 is... I'm Alive! From Black Butler. Uh... Black Butler's first ending in the series is a well-finished, I mean, well-fitted rock song. The chorus is totally catchy. It's a good recovery song for any sad episode. And this is not loud enough. Oh my god. Yeah. It's a good recovery song for, you know, sad episodes. Not, not naming any particular ones. <laughs> but anyways. And every crew... Okay, I'm, getting, I'm gonna get the name right. Don't even worry about it. Kuro... Kuro Shij... Kiro Shizuji fan can agree it has an incredibly cute an animation to go with it. Watch, watch, if, I'm gonna tell you to watch, like, 
any song from this playlist, I mean this list, watch this one. Cutest animation ever. So, yeah, just so cute. Uh, but there, but there are more songs I love more than this one. So that's why it's number 15. But hey, it's still awesome. Number 14 is. Crazy Rainbow Star from One Piece. Oh yeah, I can't forget that One Piece in this list. You can't escape from my One Piece fandom love. I am so sorry. This was the seventh opening of One Piece, and the animation has the, char has the characters on a random island with a raged dinosaur, a beach, and a shopping place. And would occasionally show other characters like Ace and Shanks. Animation is extremely cool and funny, but there is only one catchy part and nothing else doesn't really catch my eye. I mean, animation... I mean, for its time, the animation is great, but now it just looks old. Let's just say that. But, hold on. Yeah, it only has one catchy part. It's coming on right now. Don't even worry about it. Crazy, crazy rainbow star! Twinkle, twinkle, rainbow star! I'm so sorry. Oh, I thought I just saw a Pokemon on my Pokemon Go, but okay. Never mind. But yeah, only one catchy part, and that has to take down the level a little bit, so yeah. Alrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
I hope you can hear it right now. But anyways, uh, yeah, now this song gives a cowboy feel, even though this is totally not a cowboy anime, but still, it gives a cowboy feel to it, with his strumming guitars and blaring trumpets. Well, it's not blaring, like, it's like soft trumpet playing, but still, you know. And not to mention the animation is A-OK, -okay. but, uh, yee. Okay. But I really got nothing else to say, and that's kind of a bad thing, I gotta be honest. And so, that's why it's number 11, I guess. Now let's go on to the next one. Yee! Whoa! Jesus. Whoa! Trying to scare me. Okay. Okay. So <laughs> I can't stop saying okay. For... For number nine, here is yet another Black Butler song. A uh, Black Butler opening, and it is called Enamel. Here, it, I mean, let's just give a round of applause for free, freaking Black Butler songs. Okay, okay, stop clapping. Uh, anyways, all right. So already from the parts where they show circus, the sh where they show the circus performers like Beast or Joker. The animation intrigues me, and the beginning of the song sounds like a rock. Yeah. What? Okay. I don't know what to say anymore. Okay. Beginning of the song sounds like a rock and roll circus, literally. Then it shows how Seal's parents are killed, and and how he meets Sebastian and all that. And I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. So yeah, and then. Grell, you know, Grell Sutcliffe, and the other two Grim Reapers, which I forgot their names, jump in the air, and I'm shouting, whoa, 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 and then, the circus peeps are jumping and slashing, so, shut up, phone, and, and no, don't end the song, David, phone, shut up, okay, Anyways, I've been to circus peeps are slashing and jumping away. And so I'm screaming, whoa, 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 and then I die off. That's how I'm gonna die. I'm gonna be listening to this song, and I'm gonna be so overwhelmed by this beautiful music, I'm just gonna plop down on the floor. That's how amazing that is. And yeah, let's continue the script reading. Thank you very much. Basically, as if the song Enamel wasn't good enough. The animation is blowing my mind and actually tells a story. <gasps> you don't get that many songs telling a story, don't you? Yeah, it's worth it, people. It's worth it. Just amazing. Going f now, going from double digits into single digits on this list. Here is number 10 of Real Folk Blues from Cowboy Beatbot. Wait for it. Wait for it. It's coming right now. Mmm! There we go. There's the music. Oh, there we go. Fabulous. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. I'm just unleashing my inner, like, savviness in this video, I swear. Uh, anyways, this is actually the most serious and realistic out of the bunch, and the animation fits with the style of it, too. This, this song is so loud, I swear. Uh... Anyways, it's so realistic that if you play this, play the beginning part of the English, I mean, if you play the beginning part or like an English cover to the song to an anime fan, they won't even know. They won't even know it's from an anime unless they're like a die hard, hardcore anime fan. But if they're like a semi anime, if they're like a semi anime fan, they won't even notice the difference. They, they won't know. They won't know. If it's an anime, or if it's just a random song. Seriously, so realistic. Spot on. Uh, anyways. Now, let's move on. Ha 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 ha. Wow, that transition right there, though. But anyways, uh... Up for number eight is Yuso from Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Both Japanese and English lyrics are good to sing along to, and a kiddish... And a kiddish, why can't I say it? Kiddish chalk art style for the animation is gorgeous. 
Like, you would think they would do, like, the traditional anime drawing style, but no, they did a completely different style by using chalk. So, that's, that, that, like, gives it a point up, you know? But this is the one, this is the one song I actually wanted to really analyze because, well, I just thought there was a secret meaning to it. And, yes, there is. I found a meaning. And, yeah. Because both the lyrics and animation tell the story of a boy with a robotic arm. Oh yeah, and by the way, like on the screen, it'll say if I ever watch this anime or not. Because, you know, people get confused of, you know, whether I actually watch the anime or not. But yeah, it'll say if I actually watch the anime or not. Just for your convenience. But anyways, it tells the story of a boy with a robotic arm and is friends with an iron golem as his train... Well, that, a boy with a robotic arm who has an iron golem as his trainer and, most importantly, friend. Through, yeah, a trainer, protector, and best friend, sorry, through better or worse, and why are you going on to the next song? No! Guilty Crown, you're not up yet. Shh. But anyways, wow, this is going to be a long video. Well, let's just finish number eight up, shall we? Yeah, it's a boy with a robotic arm, with an iron golem, as his trainer, protector, and best friend through better or worse. And the girl and the dog work together as partners and friends to build spectacular things, I'm guessing. The lyrics tell the f- and basically the lyrics tell of a friend slash boy remembering how he met his friend slash the iron golem. And for, and for these reasons, I praise this song as top eight I literally praise it I mean animation chalk art style are really amazing but come on you can't beat the lyrics that's what's it's like the main star here the lyrics gotta pay attention gotta analyze bro but anyways that has been uh Pokemon Go no I'm kidding I probably missed a lot of Pokemon now I'm guessing well it just buzzed at me but okay uh anyways Da, 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 da. It is this sorry, sorry. I can never know we're sorry. I could always sing some Japanese, don't judge me. But yeah, this has been a really long video. Yeah, 17 minute video. Pretty sure it's super long. But, anyways, this has been a uh, go. No! Stop it, Guilty Crown! You're up next! Shut up! Wow, okay. Well, that has been the top 16 anime songs. And like I said, watch the next part because that's when we're gonna finish it up. Because we're very close to, like, you know, number one now. So, yeah. I hope you enjoyed this lovely, lovely part of, um, you know top 16 anime songs the next part will be the final part and i hope you stick around to watch that one so yeah become a ninja today and bye ninjas <laughs>